which is going to go in this direction. Like a water towel over there. This guy is barbecuing like a rat. It is possibly delicious and moist. Pretty dark. And we're doing this in the middle of the night. It's raining. And the corruption, the growth. Excuse me. This guy, this guy over here is having divisions. Okay, am I like in the right place? Yes, you see, we take the boat, we disembark, then we make a left. Here's my trusty, you know, ever present boat. Okay, come on. This thing is not very conveniently placed that that bus of them. There's like a boat over here. Here we go. Now we make a left. Okay. Ah, I see it. This is a crate. Contain alcohol. Clean water. Bartender instructions. Salt and Salvation Harbor. An alley on Wilmill Avenue. Hold on, I need to look for an alley. Alley. Is this an alley? But it's blocked by this thing. Here's an alley. Yep, might be here. Hey fella, what do you do when you see a dog? Pet it? Or kick it away. Okay, kill it because the ro the dog is rabid. But I don't like this response. I'd kill it because the dog's rabid. Right, you are. You're a new one, huh? Commodos. Yes. Lead the way. Just take me to your boss. Smuggler's meeting point. All evidence collected. Okay, apparently we're like, fast traveling somewhere, I don't know. Okay, smuggler's hideout. And, oh, this is the, the boss. Hello? I'd have broken all your bones, fella, if Papa Brute hadn't put you off limits. Oh, Papa Brute. What about this dude over here? Just calm down. No need for violence. Yeah, no need for violence. I agree. I agree. Hey, lady. What's up? How are you doing, handsome? Mighty fine, yeah? Who are you? And what the drock do you want? Let's be quick about it, kid. I don't have the whole damn day. Okay. I'm Charles Reed. I'm Charles Reed, Private Eye. Heard you can help with, uh, certain things. Hmm. <laughs> So you want a favor from me, Mr. Reed? And what would that be? I want to smuggle a man out of the city. Yes. Yeah, a lot of people want to leave Oakmont, kid. Few ever succeed. Mm hmm It won't be easy. And, like everything in life that's worthwhile, <laughs> it won't be cheap. Okay, price. So, what's it gonna cost me? Normally, I wouldn't do drock for a newcomer. But you're doing business with that old ape lover, Throgmorton. I think that's interesting. That tells me you're worth something, kid. Now, I have a job needs doing. 
but it needs to stay between the two of us. Hey, it's okay, bro. Agreed. <sighs> Guess I have no choice. So, what do I need to do? First things first. My name's Brutus Carpenter. Brutus. Rightful head of the Carpenter family. Second thing. Someone tried to kill me a week ago. Okay. Oh, you're not asking me to track them down and kill them, are you? No, kid. I've got hatchet men if I need them. And I don't want to kill them anyway. I just want to know who was gunning for me and why. Okay. Now, I know how it sounds. But after I almost died, I realized that being a hard case isn't the only option. I want to try to do things differently. What? Uh, okay. Well, redemption story, apparently. Tell me how it happened, bro. All right. Color me interested. How did this all happen? I woke up in the crematorium inside a rolled up carpet. Whoa. I had this tag on my toe like some cadaver. I was covered in this weird rancid slime. I managed to get myself out of there. But what I saw once I got home made me think I had a screw loose. What, what did you see? What did you see? Me, kid. Some palooka wearing my face and walking out my front door like all was well with the world. Ooh. So I decided to get out and hole up here. Gathered a small company and pulled myself together. Mm. Like invasion of the body snatchers. Okay, what do you remember before waking up? What was your last memory before the crematorium? I can remember clearly a dinner I had a week before the incident. After that, only bits and pieces. I remember writing something in my diary. I don't recall what, except it was important. Those notes could tell us how it all started. Okay. And I suppose that diary is still in your manor. Exactly, kid. In a strong box in my room. You have my permission to crack it if it's necessary. I'll write you the address. Okay. Any suspects? Any thoughts on who'd want to do this to you? It must be someone close to me, so I can't trust anyone. I haven't even contacted my son, Graham. Normally, I'd get him to solve this. I'm vulnerable now. I can't risk exposing myself. Another good reason to bring in an independent contractor. Okay. Where can I find the crematorium? So where would I find the city's Is crematorium? Is it next to the pupatorium? Ah, of course you don't know. You're a newcomer, after all. Here's the address. Okay. You try doing something. You must have tried to do something about this imposter already. Of course I did, kid. I wouldn't be asking for your help if this was just a walk in the park. Mm -hmm. My people said they killed that other me. It didn't change a thing. I guess they got the wrong guy. Okay, understood. I got it. Um. So why do you use a wheelchair? It appears you're quite capable of standing without aid. So why the wheelchair? Does your curiosity always beat out your courtesy? Yeah, sorry. I'll tell you if it makes you happy. Thank you. I'm old. Some days I feel tired. This wheelchair, unlike many people, has never crossed me. So I know I can count on it if I need to. Okay, do you have confidence uh, in your son? You mentioned your son, Graham. Can you tell me more about him? Graham? Why would you care? He has nothing to do with this. I don't know, bro. You sound pretty sure about that. Of course. Graham is too honest. And since the end of the war, he turned into a real bleeding heart. It's become a bit of a headache, actually. Of course, we've had our differences. Especially about the family business. But he would never hurt a fly. Let alone me. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, we got some key evidence collected here. Hey, what's your business, kid? I'm a private detector. Hey, lady. How are you doing, handsome? Nice, nice. Okay, so I'm guessing... 
we go. Thousand side quests, you know. Let's go over here. Okay, we can get down there. Is there anything here that I can steal or like borrow? Okay, I'm guessing we go down. Yeah. We got a boat. Whoa! Yeah, top marks for quantity, but so much for quality. Even my gear's in better shape. Well, I take care of my gear, you know? Yes, yeah, squishy. Okay, we're good here. Yes, yeah, squishy. Whoa! Look at dead lady here. Gotta dump this garbage. Papa Brute will be here any minute. Whoa. Yeah. We gotta dump this yeah, garbage. Yeah, I know, bro. I know. Okay. Gunpowder. Anything else besides the dead lady over here? Just growth. Okay, can I get a, another coffin? Gunpowder. Okay, how do I get out of this place? Is the exit on the first floor? What? Did I get nothing from this? That's weird. Okay, maybe the exit is over here. Hello? How do I get out of this freaking place? You like it here, newcomer? Well, get used to it. No one leaves Oakmont nowadays. We'll see, man. We'll see. Okay, so this is the thing right here. Good. So I'm just gonna like mark this right here. Uh, Smuggler's hideout. Oh, there's no need to mark it. You know, we we have it. So, Brutus Carpenter took up residence in a house on Comptroller Street. Okay. Brutus testimony. He woke up in the crematorium. There's a double in the manor, and the crematorium. Uh, a yellow tag that was from Brutus when he woke up in the crematorium. The name listed is Jack White. A tag with name Jack White. Crematorium. Hmm. What do we have here? Mind Palace. Brutus wants to be a better man, smuggler, boss, ruthless tyrant. Brutus is never going to chance. After he regains power of his family, he'll just continue as always. Brutus could uh, a, brush, a brush with death could make him more compassionate. Okay, we're gonna go with that one. We're going to go with that one. So, um, what is this? The bartender. Uh, no, I'm just gonna delete this. So, I'm guessing we are going to the mansion first. Brutus testimony. The crematorium. Okay, so the crematorium, Southern Reed Heights. Southern Reed Heights. I haven't really been to Reed Heights. Um, what? I need to find the smugglers to arrange for an escape. Yeah, I know. This one. Oh crap. Bartender instructions. Come on, don't. 
double in the manner. Okay, over here. So, Reed Heights, Southern Reed Heights, corner of Wayne Road and Phillips Street. Um, Wayne Road and Phillips Street. Ward, Bourbon, Bourbon. Washington University Hurricane Ward Oh, here's Field Strip and Wayne Road Here's the crematorium, you see? Right here Okay, so how do I get there? We, we have like this fast travel thing Okay, if we go north from where we are, there's a fast travel I'm guessing it's this one. Kind of squishy. Running around doing the cases, you know? Working the clues. Yeah, squishy. Over here. So now we go there. And now we go west east south so I'm guessing west like over here there we go excuse me Whoa, look at this! City archives! They're just shooting people here. Is this weird? Excuse me. Okay, am I going in the right direction? Okay, so just take this and go left. Hey! Dangerous, you know? Really, really dangerous. Okay. Wayne Road, Phillip Street. Southern Ridge Heights, corner of Wayne Road and Phillip Street. So I'm guessing this thing over here? Is this the Puppetorium? Or the Crematorium? Oakmont Crematorium. Office Floor 2. Funeral Hall Floor 1. More Floor 1. Crematorium Floor Minus 2. Okay, hello? Okay, we got like coffins, these things are kind of stained, you know? Hmm. Okay, some dead dude over there. We're gonna investigate the, the the other floors first. No, we can't. Yep, gotta go down. I wonder if I can craft anything. Yes, I can. No, I have maximum capacity. Submachine gun. Maximum capacity. Hmm. Okay. Check the corners. 
Check the ceilings. Use the spider sense. That's how they get you. Crematorium registry. Last week, person on duty, James Warren, list of the deceased. Seven unidentified corpses. J. Haas, Cole, okay, this week. Jack White to be cremated urgently. Mm, you see? James Warren is the person of duty. And James Warren has been on sick leave since last week. Mm. Interesting. You see, James Bo Warren appears to be like the guy. Crematorium shift schedule. Hmm. Okay. The door won't budge. Okay. Note on the door, I locked up and left early today. The keys are on the table. This morning I heard wild beasts near the cemetery. Be careful. Keys are on the table. What table? Hello? Oh, keys right there. You gotta be careful. Mm. Hello? Okay, there's some stuff over here. Crematorium. Okay, we're not gonna waste. We're gonna do this. Got it. What is this? Bent. Whoever held this poker has got to be covered in slime. Yes. Oh, look at this. And judging by the dried blood and the dent on the shovel. It was used as a weapon. Yes, it was. Oh no, there's a thing here. Someone tried to wash the stain out, but it's still slimy. Ah, it stinks. Yes, indeed. Coil springs. I'm just trying to get the things here. I don't see any other evidence. Nothing. Ah, it reeks to high heaven. What is this stuff? You see, this is the. Ah. Reeks to high heaven. This is the rug. What is this stuff? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the guy I'm helping is like a, a you know, like pot people. Someone tried to wash the stain out. Like from the it's still slimy. The, the, uh, the, the, the attack stinks. of the body snatchers thing. What else do we have here? Nothing. Nothing. Looking for some clues. We know that this thing stinks to high heaven. Someone tried to wash the stain out, but it's still slimy. Yes. Ugh, it stinks. Let me see. Mm. Someone heard wild beasts. Oh. Ugh, what a stench. Yes. Oh, we can do this. Ah! 
Okay. What by the angles is going on? Where... where am I? Okay. So they attack this guy over there. The other woke up there. I need to get out of here before he comes round. Okay. So, f one, two, three. Pretty standard. And there's another one? Apparently there's another one. Yeah, there's one over here. Ah, another one for you. Burn him first chance you get. It's urgent. Okay, so let's get a handle on what actually happened here. This is the first one. Ah, another one for you. Burn him first chance you get. It's urgent. Yes. Then he woke up. What by the angles is going on? Knock out this Wait, guy. Where am I? Escaped. Uh, I need to get out of here before he comes round. Brutus was brought in by some group who had to deal with the crematorium worker. So, Brutus woke up, knocked the guy out cold, and escaped. Yes. Key evidence collected. All evidence collected. Awesome. Okay, let's just go to the main palace. Crematorium shift schedule. Brutus stunned the crematorium worker. I need to talk to James Warren, the man who was in shift when Brutus woke up in the crematorium. He's suffering from a head injury and requires urgent treatment. Yes, that is the, the, the thing. Okay. So, how do I know where this dude is? Locate James Warren. Hearing weird things. So, just gonna go up here. And we need to, like, learn about... A wild beast in the cemetery, like over here? No. What about down here? We're in a cemetery. Things are getting spooky. Came from far away, everything's small. May he rest in peace. Um, it's like a church over here, chapel or something. Brutally murdered by a passerby. Well, it happens, so, you know, especially in a city like this one. I just gotta go over here. Whoa! Diving equipment. Interesting. Okay, so how am I supposed to do this? Look at James Warren. I need to do some research, you see. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to go like to the Okay, just uh I'm gonna delete this one. What is this? Ogman University, Department of Medicine. I'm guessing we're gonna go to the city hall. And there's there's like a fast travel point like over here. Whoa! It's too tall, very deep. Cool. I see the fast travel point. It's like over there. 
Whoa, look at this place. Someone lives here. Okay, how do I get out of here? There it is. My trusty boat. Okay, fast travel point is over here. Am I heading in the right direction? Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. It's really dark. Excuse me, lady. Okay, so over here, good. So we're gonna go to the city hall and, you know, ask about... Uh, excuse, excuse me. I wanna ask about the employee. Or maybe to the hospital? Maybe it's better if we go to the hospital, you know, because he might be injured. Hospital. I want to try this one first. I'm going to try the hospital. We're going to see if we have any luck. I think the hospital is right here. Boots and shoes. This is the hospital. Hey, Doc. Can I do a little research? Testimony double the crematorium. Uh, James Warren. Okay, James Warren. So, subject patients. Mm, district. This was Reed's Heights period after the flood. Nothing. So. Surgery. Surgery. No. Therapy. No. Asylum. No. Morgue. No. Mm. Let me see something. Was this thing actually on Reed's Height? Yeah, Reed Heights. You see, there's the, the cemetery. Subject suppliers, district, Reed Heights, department, morgue. No. So, no therapy period after the flood. Okay, I guess we're going to the. We're going to City Hall. Right here. Okay, so I exit this. Hey, dog. Excuse me. We're gonna use the fast travel right here. We're gonna fast travel there. And we're going to get some information about this guy. There's the city hall. We are like, I don't know, five or six levels separated from our current mission, but we gotta do it. So, registry, citizen records, district, read heights, subjects. Citizens? No. Newcomers? No. Enterprises? No. Other? Um, legal documents? Occupation? Oh, we might try this. Citizens? 
newcomers enterprises okay so how about enterprises legal documents citizen records mm, period after the flood okay I'm a bit confused um, Okay, just give me a second. We're gonna we're gonna search a little bit of online help for this one. Just a second. Okay, turns out I was right the first time. You need to go to the hospital. I don't know why it didn't work. Pretty sure I did the the right thing. Okay, let's just so the hospital. Uh, St. Mary's, let's just go over there. I, I, I might have like screwed up the, you know, the selection of things, but it's here in the hospital. So we're just gonna enter again. Hey nurse. So let's try again. Subject, patients, period. After the flood department surgery, it was. Mm. Uh, James Warren. Oh, we got. You see, I needed to select the clue James Warren. Head trauma, concussion. Second floor of Oakmont. I'm saying, okay. This guy is here. Good. Hey, Doc, what's Be up? Be safe. We don't have any free beds left. <laughs> <laughs> One moment it all can break. You pinch yourself, but you're already.